Exposing the secret behind your heart's pumping power, let's talk ejection fraction. This term might sound complex, but it's actually quite simple and incredibly important for understanding your heart's health. Think of your heart as a pump. Just like any pump, its efficiency is crucial for its function. Its main job? Pumping blood out to your body. This blood carries oxygen and nutrients to all your organs and tissues, keeping you alive and healthy. But here's the key question. How much blood does it pump out with each beat? This is where the concept of ejection fraction becomes essential. That's where ejection fraction, or EF, comes in. It's a measure of the heart's efficiency and is a critical indicator of cardiac health. Ejection fraction is just the percentage of blood pumped out of the left ventricle with each heartbeat. Here's a simple example. A normal heart's left ventricle fills up with about 130 milliliters of blood. This is called the end diastolic volume. This volume represents the maximum amount of blood the ventricle holds before it contracts. This is called the end diastolic volume. It's a crucial part of understanding how much blood the heart can pump out. When the heart contracts, it pumps out around 80 milliliters. This is the stroke volume. The stroke volume is the amount of blood ejected with each heartbeat. This is the stroke volume. It's a direct measure of the heart's pumping ability. So, the ejection fraction is 80 divided by 130 multiplied by 100 is equal to 62%. That is 80 milliliters out of 130 milliliters is pumped out. This means 62% of the blood in the left ventricle gets pumped out during each beat. It's a clear indicator of how well your heart is functioning. A normal ejection fraction is 50-70%. This range indicates a healthy heart that is pumping efficiently. If EF is low, 40%, it might indicate heart failure with reduced pumping ability. This condition requires medical attention and management. If EF is too high or normal with symptoms, it might suggest stiff ventricles or diastolic dysfunction. This means the heart has trouble relaxing and filling with blood. Doctors measure ejection fraction using tests like an echocardiogram. It's quick, painless, and gives crucial info about heart health. This test uses sound waves to create images of your heart, allowing doctors to see how well it's pumping. It's quick, painless, and gives crucial info about heart health. Understanding your ejection fraction can help you and your doctor make informed decisions about your heart care. So, remember, ejection fraction is just a fancy way of saying how much of the heart's blood gets pumped out with each beat. It's a vital measure of your heart's health and efficiency. If this helped clear things up, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more quick medical tips. Your heart health is important, and understanding these terms can make a big difference. See you in the next video. Stay informed and stay healthy.